welcome back to yet another video and today I'm gonna be filming my first day back at school I'm looking at myself but we'll be filming my first day back at school and everything like that I am it is the morning before the first day and I will be bringing my phone and trying to film the best I can during the school day and yeah let's just get right into the video then this is my outfit for the first day and yeah let's go hopefully I'm not overheating <laughs> And this is my makeup for the first day. You guys basically get to walk through the school day with me, see how it is and stuff like that. And I haven't been to school last year. I was online, so I'm kind of scared. Yeah, so we're going to see how it is and stuff. And hopefully it's good. Huh, hopefully I remember how to socialize and stuff. Okay, we're just, <laughs> just going to go for it. And... I'm more excited than scared though, not gonna lie. And seven, it's 6.50. I did my nails for back to school too. <laughs> Just got ready. And this is my outfit for the first day of school. And um, I will be filming on my phone at school because like, and this is my makeup. I think it's a bit too much, but I don't know. I decided to go for it. And um, my backpack is over here and I write got all ready for the day. It'll be good. And if my bangs look like that, probably throughout the day. This is my backpack. And I took a lot out of it just because in case we get books or anything like that, I can. have that much in my bag. Okay, I don't know what I'm doing. We're in very big traffic right now and school starts at 7.25, it's 7.13. Schedule, it should say with your third hour class where you have another A or B. Do you have access to specifics of these announcements today or any day the announcement? 
announcement will be emailed to all student Gmail accounts each day. Those are the announcements for today. Have a great day. everyone so oh so it is currently my editing point of view and just so you know you won't hear me talk too much in the clips i did at school because uh first of all it was the first day and i had to listen to like what the teachers had to say and stuff of course besties i listen yeah pat on the back for being a good student and also i didn't want like my friends in case they didn't want to be in the video or something then i didn't want like their voices in it so that's why you don't hear me talk that much because just in case they didn't want to be in it or something like that but yes so my first class of the day was actually wait let me check real quick my first class of the day was orchestra and i do play viola and i have have been since elementary school so that's what I went to and it was pretty like standard there wasn't that much that we actually did I guess we talked over kind of like the rules of the school like wearing masks like social distancing stuff like that what it'll look like for the year and we also did like a group activity together so like you had to find a partner and no you didn't have to find a partner I lied this was a different group activity this one in orchestra was where we had a like bingo card but where you had to go around to the other people people in your class and ask them like did you go to a different country this summer and if they said yes you'd get them to write their name down on your card and stuff like that so that was what we did in orchestra then after orchestra I had U.S. history and yeah everything pretty mandatory there we also we talked for like the first day of school for like 10 minutes but then we went straight into note taking and stuff like that we also learned that was the class where I was filming and then the teacher's like you should have your phone away by now so I stopped filming right after that but 
yeah, in case you're wondering, that was U.S. history where we just kind of learned U.S. history. And that actually is a requirement that you need to graduate. So that's why I went to it. Don't really have that much fun in history, to be honest. It's not my like favorite class of the day, but the teacher is super duper nice. I really liked my teacher for U.S. history. And for orchestra, my teacher, of course, is nice. I've had the same orchestra teacher since all of high school. And yes, so that was U.S. history. My teacher was super duper nice and I love my U.S. history teacher. And after U.S. history, I went to lunch. I didn't film anything at lunch because again, I was with my friends and they might not wanted to be in the video. So I just didn't put them there. And after lunch, I think I walked over to my AP English class and that my teacher is also really nice there. This year, like all of my teachers are super kind so far and I really do enjoy them. And yeah, last year I did not have a good teacher, not gonna lie, for one of my classes and that was a little bit of a struggle, but that's not this year. This year everyone's like super kind and stuff. I talked to a bunch of new people. I sat by someone I didn't know at lunch. I was like, okay, you know what? I'm just gonna sit by a random person. And then I just sat by a random person for lunch and now we're friends. Yeah, I know, great tactic there, but literally I saw someone sitting alone and I'm like, okay, I'll sit by them for lunch. So that was my lunch story. And for AP English, we did have assigned seating and I'm kind of like sat by the door and I really like that because it's like echo class and I don't know, it's just cozy there. And for US history, we also do have rolling chairs, which I'm a really big fan of. I love rolling chairs at school, not gonna lie. I do have rolling chairs in my, how do you call it, editing class, which is my last class of the day. And I will talk about that later on. After AP English, I went to my science class and at science, we just kind of did the standard like get to know your class kind of stuff. And we did get to pick our seats for that class. So of course I sat somewhere and like it's assigned for the whole school year now because she's like I'm not changing your seats besties. So yeah, I'm stuck there for the whole school year now. Beautiful decision. And we also chose our like seating at the lab tables because in my science class we have like the front part of the room which is like with the smart board, the teacher's desk, and then all of the chairs where the students sit. And then at the back of the classroom we have tables where we do lab work and stuff like that. So we chose our tables and seating for those as well and yeah kind of like everyday stuff there as well not too exciting but orchestra yeah that wasn't too exciting we didn't get new music we didn't start to play we just kind of like went through the day-to-day -day actions and my last class of the day is my video editing class and in that class I will know that it's super easy to do because like I thought it was gonna be like oh my goodness we're losing this super cool site because in that class you get to make your own website right by the end of the year they're like oh you'll have a website for your pro portfolio it's so cool they literally use google sites it is going to be super easy class so yeah some of my classes are super easy i tried to take easier classes this year not gonna lie so i could have more time to focus on what i like to do personally and have a fun time at school for once so that is why i took some easy classes like my science i took easy and i do not have math yet because we are in like a druplet trimester thingies so we have of one section of the year like the sections of the year is portioned off into four parts and with each part you get a different schedule and new classes so yeah I don't have math for my first section of the four sections if that makes sense of the year so in case you're wondering why I didn't have math I don't have it yet but I will have it further on in the school year and yeah, so my classes so far is orchestra, my first class of the day, US history, my second class of the day, lunch right after that, and I eat lunch around like 10 a.m., which is kind of fun, but it can be better. I'm gonna get used to it though. So 10 a.m. lunch, after lunch, I have AP English, which I go to, and we do a lot of group work, work in that class, so I really like it. And then I go to science, which is a lot of individual work, so I guess it's okay. It's I'll need to see more into it first. And then of course we also end on my video editing class going to be super easy and the teacher lets you socialize and just have a fun time so yeah that was basically how my first day of school went and then I got home but I was kind of tired of like filming and stuff so I didn't film that I did my homework right away I ate dinner like right when I get home I get home around like 3 3 30 ish and um yeah I got picked up today from school because it was the first day and we didn't really want to go to the bus but I think I will take the bus later on in the school year just since it's the first day I got dropped off and picked by my family 
And uh, yeah, that's kind of how my school day went. And I did my homework and ate dinner. And yeah, now I'm gonna get ready for the next school day. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. And I hope this summary kind of helped what was going on. And yes, I didn't talk that much at school because yeah, I didn't most want times when I talk, I talk to my friends and I don't want to like voices anyways. But yes, thank you for watching. I really do appreciate it. And let me know if you want more of my school days vlogged in the future, maybe later on in the school year and stuff. Probably be posting this on my second or third week of school. So uh, yeah, I probably, if you want more, let me know and I will definitely do it. But I thought this was interesting to make so your besties could kind of see how my day plays out at school. And yes, in the morning, I was kind of nervous, not gonna lie, but yeah, school's super fun and I really like school now and I think it'll be a great year and I hope you guys have a great year as well.